Hello and welcome to this video. In this video I am going to show my process on how I rig characters or modify the blank puppet deluxe. So first of all I will drag and drop in a rig that I am currently working on at the moment just to give a side by side comparison. So the before and the after. So, um, as you can see, it looks quite different. So the first thing that I change up with the blank puppet deluxe is the proportion of the puppet. And you can do this using the stretch tool. So the prawn is much taller than the blank puppet deluxe. So using the stretch tool, with precise move on and also the puppet mirror switched on. Um, I then use the stretch tool to kind of um, move uh, parts around to kind of make it more creature-like. So I think this looks a bit more creature-like and um, yeah, I would spend a lot more time on it, obviously, and I use actually use reference um, to get the result on the right um, there. So the second thing that I do after when I change the proportion is uh, pose the idle pose. So is a very subtle kind of posing. You don't want to go overboard, but um, I use the puppet mirror, but with it switched off, you can individually move parts, but the puppet mirror keeps everything nice and even. So I just leave that on. And the third thing that I do is um, sometimes I change the connectors of the rig in this case, the leg of the prawn is much different from a human. So what you need to do is actually physically move the connectors themselves up a little higher. So here the ankle point is pretty low. So on the prawn, I've actually extended it so that is much higher. And um, once you move the connectors, you also alter the sculpts to kind of fit in place with the connectors. And this is the result that I ended up with. Once I ended up with the rig, I then add detail. So the last thing that I do is actually add the detail and replace all the parts. So this is a little bit further down the track with the head and then a little bit further than that. This is the current state that I am working with at the moment. So my plan right now is replacing each part of the rig. So the head, the chest, the upper arm, lower arm, the pelvis and the legs and all of that. So to summarize the steps, um, one, you use the stretch tool to change the proportions. Two, you pose the character. And three, you change up the connectors, either add connectors or modify it. And then the fourth thing, add more detail.